Hello, in this video I'm going to discuss a research paper on Formula 1 and the value of pole position. This is research by Wesselbaum and Owen from 2020. And the question is, what is the benefit of pole position in Formula 1 racing? And their hypothesis is, starting the race in front position on the grid has advantages. Driver can gain an advantage going into the first corner. Easier to avoid collisions than starting in the middle of the pack. You have cleaner air and better aerodynamics from not following other cars. More flexible pit stop strategy. They use data on all Formula One races from 1950 through 2013, or 64 seasons. There's 901 races in their data set. The researchers have the starting position for each driver and end of race finishing position. In total, over 20,000 observations. Some descriptive statistics. Retirements due to technical problems accounted for 34% of all observations, or almost 7,000 observations. Technical problems peaked in the 1980s at 43% and then fell to a low of 21% in the 2000s. Accidents roughly are about 1,600 or 8% of all observations. And 117 or 13% of the 900 races were in the rain. So the researchers are controlling for rain. And now some descriptive statistics on pole position. 40% of the races were won from the pole position, or 363. In 1991, 75% of the races were won from pole position, while only 13% were won in 1982. By decade, wins from pole position was the highest at almost 51% in the 2000s, largely attributable to Michael Schumacher, and lowest at 28.4% in the 1980s. So estimating the value of the pole position, again, the central question here is what is the effect of pole position on the probability of winning the race? The authors want to isolate the effect of pole position on winning, so they control for variables that may also affect winning. The driver's ability, track layout, rain, the constructor performance. And so here's the results. Pole position increases the probability of winning the race by 10 percentage points. Rain does not affect the probability of winning. Each one position back from pole at the start of the race reduces the probability of winning by 3.3 percentage points. The value of pole position varies by decade, likely from changes in rules and regulations and technological developments. So in the 1950s and 1960s, pole position was not statistically associated with the probability of winning. In the 1970s, pole position increased the probability of winning by 5.4 percentage points. In the 1980s and 1990s, once again, pole position was not statistically associated with the probability of winning. However, in the 2000s, pole position increased the probability of winning by almost 15 percentage points. Okay, that's it.